Okay, what we got here now is a fixture I put together to hold the rods parallel so we can bore the IDs on the on the caps and the rods. They've all been babbitted and we'll just make a cut down there. It's a little bit small right now because we want to sneak up on a dimension. We need a thousandths and a half per side for oil clearance. And we'll just come down in here and this is set up for boring the IDs on the rods. This is how it's done. All that chip that's coming out of there, we can actually put it back in the bucket, melt it again, and this stuff's about $60 to three pounds, so you can save it and use it again. Makes a nice true bore through there. I should be about 5,000 undersized right now, and then we'll make a final cut. But this is how it's done. Shut off the feed, the quill. And there you go. There's the bore.